to a tale of a wild rescue. In fact, it's two tales, two dogs abandoned by their owners in the mountains off of Highway 50. They're safe and recovering tonight because of some creative thinking by the El Dorado County Animal Services Department. CBS 13 Steve Large is in El Dorado County with the mission they made possible. Well, it would be easy to call these two German Shepherds underdogs when they were dumped on the side of the freeway, but now that they've survived and they've been rescued, they've become favorites here at this El Dorado Animal Shelter. Meet newly named Ash and Toby, two German Shepherds still trying to satisfy their big appetites after being abandoned on Highway 50 near Bridal Veil Falls. No more cheat. No more cheat. Where they were left starving for at least two weeks. El Dorado County Animal Services put together a mission on this mountain to bring them to safety. Well, it was monumental. After initially being spotted, the dogs would retreat into the wilderness when animal control officers first tried to help them. So Officer Ashley Bragg created this giant metal cage with a trap door and a remote camera to watch and wait. It was the ability for us to see after hours instead of sitting out there all night long. Bragg would watch these videos live on her phone. So you see him sniffing around inside the trap, but not fully trusting the trap yet. Finding the right combination of food to coax the two inside the cage was not easy. We've tried everything from hanging T-bone steaks all the way to what caught them was some cat food and some liver pate with a, a little bit of other dry dog food mixed in it. You gonna sit? Yeah, you can sit. Rescue relief. And now recovery in progress. Uh, it boggles my mind to see people abandon animals, just dump them. These two lovable buddies left on the side of a mountain, Come on, sweetheart. saved by dogged determination. And El Dorado County Animal Services wants to put about another 20 pounds on each of the dogs before they adopt them out together to a new home. Meantime, they're asking for anybody from the public who knows where these dogs' owners might be to come forward.